Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and keep watching more details. Bold and beautiful S. Thomas may return to LA. With an even bigger shock for Brooke than Hope and we don't mean Ivy, either. Admit it, you're assuming the same as we are that bold and beautiful is bringing back Ashley Brewer as Ivy to hook her up with Thomas overseas, so that by the time Hope hops on a plane to Paris, she'll already have missed the boat, so to speak. But the soap could be pulling the fastest of fast ones on us, setting us up to expect a Thomas Ivy hookup when, in reality, he ll be reconnecting with Amber, who just happens to be in the city of love for son little d's graduation from culinary school. Newly re-energized by their affair, Thomas decides that he s ready to return to LA. His heart is too full of love for Amber to even remember that it was ever broken. As an added bonus, nobody can say that he s too young for Amber now. Needless to say, Hope will be shocked that Thomas so quickly reheated things with his old flame. But Brooke will be even more horrified, she thought she'd finally gotten Amber out of her hair for good. At least this time, Brooke can tell herself, Amber isnt trying to tie down her son, Rick. When Thomas comes back with Amber in tow, they should also be bringing along little D. Not only could he spend some quality time with Dad Deacon when did they last even see each other but the budding chef could begin his culinary career working at an L.A. hot spot. Given the hot mess that RJ and Luna's relationship is about to become, Little D could also let her start over, romantically speaking, with a nice, new guy. That is, if he is, in fact, nice. He could take after his dad back in his bad boy days. As the sun dipped below the horizon, casting hues of orange and pink across the Los Angeles skyline, the city buzzed with its usual energy. Yet, within the sleek corridors of Forrester Creations, an atmosphere of anticipation hung thick in the air. Whispers danced among the employees, speculating about the return of a prodigal son a man whose name stirred both admiration and apprehension in equal measure Thomas Forrester. For weeks, rumors had swirled about Thomas's impending return to the family-owned fashion empire. Some spoke of redemption, of a man transformed by his time away, while others whispered of more sinister motives, fueled by the shadows of his troubled past. But one thing was certain Thomas Forrester's return would not be without its drama. Brooke Logan, the matriarch of the Forrester family and a woman whose life had been entangled with Thomas's in ways both profound and painful, braced herself for the storm that was about to hit. She sat in her office, the scent of fresh flowers mingling with the faint aroma of uncertainty. Her mind wandered back to the tumultuous events that had led to Thomas's departure, to the secrets and betrayals that had left scars on their family's legacy. As if on cue, the door to Brooke's office swung open, and in stepped a figure bathed in the golden light of the setting sun. Thomas Forrester stood before her, his presence commanding yet tinged with an air of humility. Brooke's heart skipped a beat as she beheld the man who had once been both her greatest adversary and her deepest regret. Thomas, she breathed, her voice barely above a whisper. Brooke, he replied his tone measured yet tinged with emotion. It's been too long. Their eyes met, a silent exchange of memories and unspoken truths passing between them. Brooke felt a wave of conflicting emotions wash over her anger, sorrow, longing. But beneath it all, there lingered a flicker of hope, a glimmer of possibility that perhaps, just perhaps, redemption was within reach. Thomas broke the silence, his voice steady yet tinged with urgency. I didn't come back to cause trouble, Brooke. I came back to make amends, to set things right. Brooke studied him, searching for any hint of deception in his words. But all she saw was a man haunted by his past, a man yearning for forgiveness and redemption. Slowly, she nodded, a gesture of tentative acceptance. Actions speak louder than words, Thomas, 
she replied, her voice tinged with skepticism. You have a long road ahead of you if you truly want to make amends. Thomas nodded, his expression earnest. I know. And I'm willing to do whatever it takes. As the days turned into weeks, Thomas threw himself into his work at Forrester Creations, determined to prove himself worthy of a second chance. He collaborated with his family members on new designs, pouring his heart and soul into each creation. And with each passing day, Brooke found herself slowly letting go of the resentment and anger that had consumed her for so long. But just as peace seemed within reach, a new storm loomed on the horizon one that would shake the very foundations of the Forrester family. It began innocently enough, with a chance encounter between Thomas and a familiar face from his past Caroline Spencer. Caroline, the mother of Thomas's son Douglas, had been a pivotal figure in his life before her untimely death. And now, as Thomas found himself drawn back into her orbit, old feelings resurfaced threatening to unravel the fragile peace he had fought so hard to attain. Brooke watched from the sidelines, her heart heavy with a sense of foreboding. She knew that Thomas's rekindled relationship with Caroline could only lead to heartache for him, for Douglas, and for everyone caught in the crossfire. And yet, try as she might, she could not bring herself to intervene. As the days passed, Tensions simmered beneath the surface, threatening to boil over at any moment. And then, just when it seemed that the storm had reached its peak, a new revelation rocked the Forrester family to its core. It came in the form of a letter, delivered to Forrester Creations in the dead of night. Brooke was the first to read its contents, her hands trembling as she unfolded the delicate parchment. What she read sent shockwaves through her entire being a revelation so stunning, so unexpected, that it threatened to shatter everything she thought she knew. Thomas Forrester was not the only one returning to Los Angeles. With a sinking heart, Brooke realized the truth Hope Logan, her beloved daughter and the light of her life, was coming home. But she was not alone. She was returning with a secret a secret that would change everything for Brooke, for Thomas, and for the entire Forrester family. As the sun rose on a new day in Los Angeles, Brooke Logan stood at the precipice of a new chapter in her life. The past and the present collided in a whirlwind of emotion and uncertainty, leaving her breathless with anticipation for what the future held. And through it all, one thing remained certain in the world of the bold and the beautiful nothing was ever as it seemed. And as Thomas Forrester prepared to face the consequences of his actions, and Hope Logan prepared to unveil her shocking secret, the stage was set for a drama unlike any other. For in the world of high fashion and high drama, where passion and betrayal reign supreme, one truth remained constant love, in all its boldness and beauty, would always find a way to prevail.